well done, Charlie. I think you've got a very uh, confident horse and rider. Great combination. Yeah, absolutely. Um, look, I, I think the only only query we had over the 2,400 metre distance today was whether he'd settle well enough. Um, but Kieran just put him to put him to sleep nice and early. Um, got a lovely economical run, and I think he was relatively soft on him late. He sort of put the stick away and knew he had the leader covered from about the 200. So. Look, he, he's, a, he's a beautiful son of the autumn sun uh, who's going to go from strength to strength. We, like I think we said it a couple of weeks ago that we, we did think he was going to be our JJ Atkins horse as a two-year-old and he sort of never lived up to it, but he, he's finally coming to fruition now, so it's very satisfying for the whole team at home. It's been a sort of three-year working progress, but um, but now he's here and, look, he's, um, he's, he's a, obviously a talented stayer in the making. You've got the Metrop covered with unusual legacy, so what are you going to aim this horse at? Well, I did actually say to Kieran as he walked in um, off the last one, I said, oh, this next one, you're going to have an interesting question if you win on that as to which one you're going to need to ride. Um, so, look, see what Kieran has to say and see which one Chris w- wants him on. But, um, look, they're, they're, they're going to be two, two beautiful stays. One's obviously going to get up to that distance and one's already proven at that distance. So that's, I guess, the... the, the the bit that splits them, yeah. um, but great problem to have. Good job, well done. Thank you. Congratulations, K Man. You're on fire, mate. Yeah, nice day so far, Brownie. Best shit to come, hopefully. <laughs> it's nice when you've got decisions and <clears throat> you know, op- uh, you know, options. This bloke, they keep raising the bar, but he just keeps getting better and better. Yeah, he does. That's for sure. You know, tick that mile and a half box today, which was the query, because he needed to settle. Um, you know, two runs ago, he got in a race where he didn't settle. Last time he did, and today he did again off, off the back of that nice tempo, which was a little bit of a surprise. I thought they'd just go medium, but they went a strong pace, which which aided our chances and, you know, got into a lot, nice spot. But I was happy to see Jay come off the bridle at about the half mile. I thought, well, I've got you out of the way when I want you. So that sort of helped, and I was able just to get him in the clear and horse did the rest. Well done, bud. Thanks.